Hello, welcome inside the Chris Evans Podcast. It is week 10 of the high school football season, and we are getting ready for some playoff scenarios. Today, we take a look at Class 2A Division 2. Remember, Class 2A got split up this year from Division 1 and now Division 2. And, uh, boy, there are a lot of scenarios in each of the four districts in this one. Some teams are placed in there for sure, but there's going to be a lot of teams that can finish second, third, third, fourth. It's a lot of moving parts in 2A, too, with these playoff scenarios. Good thing is after the games, we'll have a bracket and get ready for some exciting first-round matchups to see who – eventually to see who the first-ever 2A2 champion is. Let's take a look at District 1 and 2A2 first. We do know the Stroud – is the district champions. And we know the Gold Bugs have Alva. They're the runners-up, and Luther is third. Pretty simple. One, two, three. Stroud, Alva, Luther. From there, Hennessy, the key game, Hennessy is at Cassidy to decide the fourth spot. Cassidy qualifies with a 10-point win, or if Luther defeats Stroud. It wouldn't depend on Luther defeating Stroud. Stroud, a heavy favorite there. So Cassidy uh, not only has to win, but, uh, but with a 10-point victory as well as they take on the Eagles of Hennessy. Dropping down to District 2, Holdenville. They are the district champions. What a season they're having. A huge victory last week over Davis to clinch the district title. They're 6-0. Davis has qualified for the playoffs. Where they, Davis has had a tough schedule. Uh, starting the season off 0-3, then losing to Holdenville last week. Beggs, Community Christian, and Dibble, and Dibble are fighting for the final two playoff spots. Davis is in. And we're waiting to see who's going to get that spot. I certainly think Beggs would be there. Beggs visits Dibble. They'll be favorite there. And Davis Davis fits, visits Community Christian. Davis will be a favorite there as well. So we'll see how those play out uh, with playoff scenarios. Who will be on the road? Who will be hosting? In 2A, or excuse me, in District 3, Adair is the champion. Beat at Colcord earlier this year. And Colcord has qualified. Uh, Kansas at Colcord. How about that first? Uh, how about that game in Week Ten? Kansas at Colcord decides second place in that district. Salina, a, an upset victory over Kansas a couple weeks ago. They're at Wyandotte and are vying for the last playoff spot there. So Wyandotte, they're they're at Keys. Wyandotte uh, certainly think would be a uh, favorite there to win that ball game. Salina visits the Dragons of Chelsea High School, who has not won a district game this year. So, sign a heavy favorite there. Wydot qualifies with a win and a Kansas win, which is very likely to happen. Salina, they need it. They need they qualify with a win and a Kansas loss, and simply that's not going to happen there. Salina qualifies if it if if it and Wydot both lose. Again, that's going to be a hard task for that to happen for Salina to get into the playoffs. Looking at District 4, Valiant at Vienne. That will decide the district championship. And uh, it's a 5-1 and one Valiant team against a 6-0 Vienne. Vienne has been the number one team for a super majority of the football season in 2A Division 2. Valiant wins the title with a nine-point win or any win if Henrietta loses against Atoka. Henrietta, a big favorite there to, to do that. Henrietta, with that victory, would finish second and a valiant loss. Spiral, Spiral's still there at Antlers. That will decide the fourth spot. So you look at that uh, first round possible matchups. There's nothing in stone yet for a. There's a lot of scenarios still to be played out there. Um, I would certainly think Stroud would host somebody like Community Christians, maybe a Beggs. Uh, uh, then you have either Kansas or Colcord at maybe a, Val- a Valiant or a Vianne. Uh, Spyro at Adair, possibility. Luther at Davis. Could have Hennessy at Holdenville. There's a lot of parts. 2A2 has a lot of uh, scenarios that has to play out before you can put it in there. Some classes have, we know, a couple of first-round matchups for sure. 2A2, Division 2, we don't have that. So that will be a fun scoreboard to watch throughout the night on Friday night to see who wins and how by, by how many points to determine the playoff bracket. It'll be a fun class to see who the first-ever state champion is there. Vian has been so close over the last couple of years, have not been able to get to that championship. Davis has won it. Uh, they've had a tough schedule. Can Will that make them better for the playoffs? Could someone like Stroud, Adair, Corcord make that run for the first time ever in Division II? A lot of, a lot of questions. That's what makes it so fun here in 2A Division II. That'll do it here for this part. 
Don't forget, High School Huddle, Wednesday night, 6 o'clock, on our YouTube channel, Second Banana Media, or watch it on Facebook, search the High School Huddle, like that page, and we will talk high school football from 6 o'clock to about 7.30-ish. Sometimes we've gone to 8 o'clock, and bring your questions and comments. We'd be glad to interact with you on our live show. Until then, best of luck to your high school football team this week.